Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Capricorn. This is for Capricorn Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of October 18th through the 26th. Okay, so what do we have? I did one for the week before. If you're watching this during that week, I would suggest you go back and watch, you know, the one for the week that you're watching it. But here we go. What do we have for Capricorn? So stick with that right there. Week of October twenty, October 18th through the 26th. Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Wall. Misunderstanding. Claw. Be careful. Do not take risks. So... You're going to have to be careful this week. There's going to be some sort of misunderstanding. Uh, be careful. Four of Cups, reverse. Somebody is seizing an opportunity. So they're taking an opportunity that they missed. Now they're taking it. Okay? They're seeing an opportunity and they're taking it. Okay? Um, we're letting go of the regret. This is the end of stagnation. They're ready to move forward. So somebody is going to be moving forward. Five of Swords reversed. Page of Pentacles. So this is a new doorway that is opening. Okay, a new path is opening up for you. Uh, it's not going to be easy. Okay, it's not going to be easy. You're going to be starting starting something from scratch. Okay, that means this is a new path, it's a new endeavor, it's a new enterprise, needing to start over. It's definitely not going to be easy um, going down a new path. Over here, I feel like this must be somebody that you're dealing with. I'm not sure if you're dealing with somebody that is hostile. The Five of Swords is, you know, it's a hostile situation, it's volatile, it's arrests, it's burials, it's bloodshed okay it could be exposing a crime or there could be a crime i'm not sure what is going on um, but the five of swords reversed um not listening to a warning somebody is not heeding a warning so uh, somebody is taking an opportunity um there's some sort you you're you're there's some sort of tense situation that you are in with somebody there's a lot of tension um, strength card, strength card. I feel like you, you have somebody here that wants control, that is very controlling. There's, and I feel like this is somebody around you that is very, very controlling, very, very powerful, that likes to be in control. They enjoy having power. This is very, both of these cards are very powerful. We have somebody here that wants to be in control. Queen of Swords over here. So, new perspective is needed. You're going to be gaining a new, I feel like this is your side over here. I feel like you are going to be gaining a new perspective this week and you will need to protect yourself. And that's why this is here. You're going to need to think fast, perhaps. Uh, be honest with yourself. Be authentic. Be truthful. Observe and reflect. Okay, because you're going to be presented with a new opportunity or something. Okay, because this is a golden opportunity to go down a new path. Hmm. Saying goodbye. You may be say somebody may be saying goodbye. They're leaving an emotionally disappointing situation behind. Somebody may, I feel like you got somebody here that is saying goodbye to you. This person is, is because this is saying goodbye as well. I feel like there's somebody that is saying goodbye to you. They're leaving. They're leaving. Uh, this is somebody that is very, um, maybe, uh, you know, I think of the strength card as determined, determination. Uh, this person is strong. They're courageous. 
um, facing their fears. Somebody's leaving, um, but this person also enjoys power and control with these two cards. Nine of one of cups reversed. Now this is an overindulgence going overboard. Uh, this is somebody that goes to extremes that, uh, you know, this person may drink too much. They may eat too much. They may eat too little. They, they go to extremes and this is, this is not happy. This is dissatisfied. I feel like you are dealing with somebody that isn't happy. They're not happy and they're leaving. They're leaving. They may go overboard. They may do something, um, extremely out of character okay something about character here um judgment judgment make a judgment call this is uh the end of things it is it is this is the end this is a life-changing decision this is the end this is absolution Seeing the truth. Truth is being revealed. Uh, this is somebody that is ready. They are ready to be held accountable for their actions. or to. This is like responsibility being assigned. They're ready to accept responsibility. This is the end of things. This is an awakening or an epiphany that it's time to go. Somebody, you know, is is uh, choosing to walk away with both of these cards They're from a battle. There's been some serious fighting here. It's been very, very hostile. But this is this is like going overboard. Not happy. It's almost like uh, going to extremes. We could have somebody here that is uh, very disappointed with life, you know. You could be dealing with a Leo. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. Um, but this is very hostile. It's a very hostile situation. This is the end, though. It's the end of it. We have right, we have somebody here that is choosing to uh, leave. Okay? They're choosing to leave. They're choosing to end this battle, you know? They may go to extremes. They may overdo something. I mean, this is like overdoing it with alcohol or drugs or something like that. Um, magician reversed. There's some sort of mental imbalance here. Hallucinations, perhaps, or... or uh, an abuse of power not qualified. This is a liar. A manipulator, somebody that is delusional, this is not planned. There could be even some violence here with these two cards. Somebody could act violently. They could even have some violent hallucinations. I mean, I don't know what is going on here, but um, the re this is taking action without thinking. Somebody could do something without thinking. You know, there's some sort of personality disorder right here. We have somebody here that is unbalanced. And, you know, they may make a judgment call that it's time to go and it could happen. This could be all of a sudden. Um, this is the end. This is a life-changing decision. Somebody is making a life-changing decision to leave because of this eight of cups somebody is leaving okay they are they're leaving a battle they're done fighting they're done and they're doing it very very suddenly you know it's a and they do it without thinking okay they it's like they just do it Now, this person right here, if this is you or somebody in your circle, this person is going to be getting a new opportunity. 
Okay, because you know whether it's you or somebody else, this person is is getting an opportunity to, to. This is a gift of some sort, going to be offered a gift. This is unexpected. It's an unexpected opportunity. It may have something to do with a child. I don't know. This Queen of of Swords is very authentic, very truthful, very intelligent, very wise, very smart. Now that could be your energy or somebody in your circle. This Queen of Swords, it, could, it feels like it's a motherly figure. She has some sort of information or something. Somehow she is involved here. She may she may have some sort of information that I don't know helps I don't know anyway this is this is somebody that is angry the page of the page of swords this is somebody that is very angry that is taking an opportunity this person is going to take an opportunity that they didn't take in the past they're taking it now okay they're angry and they're upset and they see that the, that this is a golden opportunity. To take right now so somebody is, and it, this does come from a misunderstanding okay so somebody is going to be taking an opportunity and it's a battle the five of swords is a hostile situation it definitely is so somebody's going to be taking an opportunity to win at all costs because that's the meaning of the five of swords okay and I feel like it's going to cause an ending because judgment is double tens it's a double ending okay it's double I don't know what this is. I almost said something that I, I hope that I'm not even going to say it. Anyhow, it's double. And um, I feel like uh, it's it's going to uh, really not make you happy at all. Whatever this is, you're not going to be happy with the outcome. Um, judgment is release and accept and allow you're going to need to release, accept, and allow. You're going to need strength this week. You're going to need a lot of strength. You're going to need strength. I'm getting the goosebumps to deal with whatever this ending is. Something is ending, and this is my second Capricorn reading. I couldn't let the first one go through because it was so scary. So, um... I think that you're going to be experiencing a huge loss this week that you did not expect. We had the Ace of Pentacles in reversed right over here. So a huge loss. And right before the Ace of Pentacles reversed was the Three of Swords in the upright, which is heartache, grieving, suffering. So I feel like you are right before the Ace of Pentacles reversed. So you are, and this is a lost opportunity, a missed op missed. Somebody is losing something. They are. They're losing something. This is the end. It is the end of a conflict, believe it or not. Okay, this is the end of a conflict. It's the end of a struggle. Somebody is is uh, taking action without thinking. And it's going to end with a judgment. Okay, judgment is the end. It is. Um, karma. There is some sort of karma here. And it, there is there is a saying goodbye. So I feel like you are going to be saying goodbye to somebody this week. And I think it's going to be very emotional. I think it's going to be very emotional. I feel, feel like you have somebody that um, is very angry that is around you. And I feel like they are taking an opportunity to... Uh, I don't know, it feels like hurt another person or hurt, you know, I don't know what's going on, but it, they could hurt themselves. I mean, I hate to say that. I hate to say that, but um, this is a very tricky situation. Um, whoever this is, is going to be held accountable for their actions. And this is about being held accountable responsibility being assigned this is absolution this is the end somebody is making a life decision okay this is a major life decision um and it does have to do with a fight okay this is this is a battle but this ends the battle whatever that means to you 
Um, somebody may even be asking for forgiveness. If you look at it this way, somebody may be asking for forgiveness. But I feel like there's revenge here. I do. I feel like there, this is revenge. So I feel like there is somebody that is taking revenge and, you know, I feel like it's going to be a tough week. Good luck.